Alright guys, it's Madman Rab here and I'm just going to do a very quick tutorial on how to protect your Gears of War 3 game save without the need of any backups or anything on your PC, right? So there are a few things I'm going to explain first before we get into how you can predict it. So there's two versions of your data, right? You have two versions of your actual data, which is your ribbons, your rank, your medals and stuff. And one of those versions you have and it's on your console. And the other version is on the Gears of War 3 server, right? And when you when you go on to Gears of War 3, the very first thing that happens is you'll see down the bottom right later on when I load up Gears 3 is it says like updating profile to the server sort of thing so every time you load up Gears of War 3 online whatever stats are on your profile your local profile get updated and overwrite anything on the server and um, this happens because if you can imagine playing offline and for instance you're going for weapon kills and if you can hear that ambulance outside I apologize but I'm not restarting so if, if you imagine you get a thousand Lancer kills offline, okay, and then you load up Gears of War 3, sign into Xbox Live, and you don't have those thousand kills, that would be kind of pointless. So what happens then is when you load into Gears of War 3, your stats with the extra 1000 kills update onto the server, and that is how you can keep track of stats. That's how Xbox Live and Gears of War 3 can keep track of your stats when you play offline and when you play online. So the only problem occurs is when your local stats have nothing. It's completely wiped. And a lot of reasons why people get reset is loading screens on Gears of War 3. So if you were to disconnect from Xbox Live while the game's saving your data, if you leave a ranked game, if any of those reasons, your data can be wiped on your local profile and you do happily enough have the backup on the server but how do you get that data when I've just said your stats um, update anything on the server so first thing we're going to do before I load up Gears of War 3 is go to your settings and you're going to go to your system you're going to go to your storage and you're just going to go to your games I'm going to go down to my Gears of War 3 and I'll go down to my player data. So you can see this one here is my player data, and on the right hand side you can see it's my gamer tag, Madman Rab. This player data is fine, and the reason I'm telling you it's fine is because on the left hand side it's got the Gears of War 3 Crimson Omen. I'm just, how do you know it's not fine? I'm going to go to my uh, Modern Warfare 3 because I checked, and there is an example of corrupted data which I'm just going to find for you right now. It's a big yellow circle. Here we go. Here's corrupted data. So see if your Gears of War 3 player data says it's corrupted. It says that, or it's got the wee symbol beside it. Just delete it. So I'll go back to my Gears of War 3 data. I don't need to delete mine because mine is fine, but you would just click on it and delete. What this would do is this would delete your local data. So for instance, it's all completely wiped and your stats have nothing, you've lost all your medals, you've lost everything. What you would do is you would load up Gears of War 3 and because you don't have any data on your console um, you will download your proof, your data from the server. The server has a copy of um, the last data you had when you signed into Xbox Live so that version has all your stats and it would just download and you would lose nothing the reason people get reset, like I say, is because your data is corrupted and it's everything's been reset. You sign into Gears of War 3, uh, you load up Gears of War 3, and your stats of nothing overwrites the server's version automatically before you can even check if you're being reset or something. So I'm just going to load up Gears of War 3 in a moment, and you'll know, I'll point out the screen that appears so you know everything's like... Um, checking the date and stuff. I can't remember the exact words it says on Gears of War 3 but this guys, if you have any reason to believe that you might have been reset then check your player data and if it's if it doesn't say it's corrupted it's fine and if it says it's corrupted just delete it and when you load up Gears of War 3 you'll get a brand new version of the data that you last had when you were online so you've not lost any rank, you've not lost any ribbons or um, medals or anything for your seriously and 
you don't need any saves on your computer guys, I'm just looking at the time, we're now at like 6 minutes, I do apologise, but I just wanted to give you the theory behind it, I don't want to just tell you to check it and delete it, because you'll be like, why? So it's this menu here, if you press start, you can see it's loading your profile, and then it's updating the content, so, and stuff like that. But see if you deleted your profile for your console, because it was corrupted, then you would just download, there it goes, it said they are reading saved data. So if you had lost all your data because you say quit at a ranked match or you disconnected, when you press start there, you would have just downloaded a fresh version from the server onto your profile and your rank and your stats would remain. So guys, that's a little precaution. If you have ever any doubt that your profile has been corrupted, just follow the steps there. I'll also put them in the description because it, it doesn't need to be as wordy as what I've just done. But yeah guys, there's just a few little videos I'm going to make over the next few days that I know about and I think can help you. So if this has helped you guys, please leave some comments and if you um, tell me your experiences with Gears of War. And I really hope this um, prevents me getting any more messages saying, Madman Rab, I've been reset, what can I do? Because unfortunately, you can do nothing about it unless you have a backup on your PC. But with this method, you don't. Alright guys, so until next time, I'll see you later.